Hey kids, forget about your dudes of calls, forget about your theft grands off those, and it's time to play some Dragon Ball Z. What happens when you put throw up plus this, you get Dragon Ball Z. Battle of Z. Now when I was a kid, I loved Budokai. I, I was a, it was one of the best fighting games I've ever played. At this time, I was watching the anime, with such bad guys as Frieza, him, her, it, and Cell, who was a bad guy, very bad guy, who absorbs your Android 18 to get his power. And Majin Buu, look at him, he's adorable, he, he's adorable, oh, and he turns into, oh god, kill it with fire, kill it with fire, Just, and there's Goku, the main protagonist of the series, and he turns into this when he's pure awesome, the legendary Super Saiyan. With the help of his friends, he must defeat all evil and protect Earth. Now, when I was playing the game, uh, I was like, I was so excited. It was gonna be, it was gonna continue on in the adventure. It was gonna replay the memories. It was gonna bring back this, this feeling I had when I first started playing the fighting games. I got into the game and I was like, pew, pew, pow, 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 pia, pia. I was like, oh my god. So, after the first mission, you get to pick two characters. And I soon found out that, that you could even have more. And this made the game a lot more hectic and a lot more painful to play. Now, you see, when you have so much on the screen, you have problems seeing and getting into the game, like, on a, on a mental level. And um, I thought this made it really hard. And plus, that also made it easy to die. And that's when you run out of life. You will, after you run out of uh, retries, it becomes impossible to play the game. I've tried. I actually, I'm on like halfway through the game. Now the AI was relatively it was pretty good comparatively to some games. I played games with terrible AI. This one had a functional, barely noted, I guess, and it was fairly well programmed. I, I enjoyed that part. It was it made some it made when you had lives the game playable. Another great thing about this was the Naruto suit. It was like Naruto plus, you know, Goku. Like, Super Saiyan Goku. Like, awesome Goku. And you get Super Naruto Saiyan person. One thing I, another thing I actually liked about this game was that um, its graphics, they were relatively good. They were kind of classic, like some of the old fighting games. And I'm going to give another point towards it. They were kind of cartoonish and comic book. I liked it. Overall, I give this game a 4 out of 10. The graphics and the Naruto suit and everything else that was good about the game really helped it, you know, because it was good. I only suggest giving this game from if it's cheap on Xbox Live or if it's free on Gamefly. And Thanks I so hope for watching. Um, if you like this video, subscribe and if you like it, do. Especially like it. Now, um, this is going to be a new series of mine. Um, I'm gonna, it's not just going to be reviews. It's going to be about games and stuff like that. So, uh, leaving the doobly-doo. Uh, hope you guys like this video, and I'm out. I'm Thor's Thunder. I've been your host, and I congratulate you on being alive. Go. Hey, kids, forget about your grand office. Uh, and forget it. It's not a school computer. <laughs> this is a school And anyway, I'm this in the main shot. God damn it. Right. This is going in bloopers.